If you really like the idea of a pop-up grip, but you really can't stand the idea of an add-on accessory, then why don't you check out Handle New York's cases? They're really fantastic. They're made out of fabric or leather, or even high-end plastic, and they're the brainchild of New York artist and restaurant owner, Alan Hirsch. I was able to see Handle's latest cases at CES 2019 and speak to actor and Handle fan, Jamie Foxx, about how technology like Handle's can help people be more creative. So tell us a little bit about Handle and how you got involved. First, man, my mate, Nick, you want to you wanna say hello? Absolutely. Come on, Nick Verano. <laughs> Nick Verano here. Hi, He's Nick. the one Hi, who pulled you? me Good. in. And he, 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 he got me excited about this because, especially in our business, you know, social media, whatever, when you got your phone, it's the most precious thing in, in your hand. It has your whole life in it. And what's the first thing that happens? It slips out of your hand. Uh, or you don't have the right case. This gives you the case and the ability to hold on to it, not slip it. And I know it's a simple thing, but it's so effective. Like say right now, we want to do a selfie, me and you. <laughs> me and you and Nick. All right. What, I ain't got to worry about that slipping out of my hand. Oh, shucks, we up in there. Nice. Yeah, best selfie ever. And look at that. See here right there? So, and it also has another little feature here that you put this in the back, and I'm gonna let your cameraman see that. The first thing we're trying to do is, when you're doing your FaceTime, or you're trying to watch a movie or whatever, simple, little apparatus, but it means so much. And so it's it's really a cool product. It's all different, what is it? Four different textures? Four different textures on there. Uh, and all, all the colors are the rainbow, you know? So we're, 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 we're open to everyone's color. <laughs> How did you Any end up picking the camera? The cat, cause I just wanted, I felt, I felt, I felt patriotic. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I felt patriotic today, yeah. so and I might go shoot some guns later. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> let's really? That. Let's cut that. <laughs> let's cut that. No, but seriously. <laughs> but it's uh it, it, it like I said, it's just a simple added thing, but it, it means so much. And then the way Alan designed it, it's so I mean the art of what he's created I thought was pretty amazing. Yeah, too. very much so. And then so like I said, uh when Nick told me to come on out. Got me excited about it, and so we're gonna um, show more people, show the world, and tonight we're gonna have a great time getting a handle on things. Sorry. 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 Well, I wanted to ask you though about mm. tech in general, and how important do you think tech is to help people be creative like this? I'm gonna tell you what's great about tech. My daughter's 10 years old, right? Her niece, nephew, 12 and 16. They are more tech savvy than I am. What we've used with just them, just about, about the kids. I allow them to play their games, right? But I also make them every day, 15, 30 minutes to an hour, show me something educational. And what's interesting about tech is, is that everybody can be involved in the creative process. My kids love the different games. I won't say all the games that they, that they love, but I said, why don't you start thinking about creating your own? And so, like I think, the tech world, like I said, it's it's infinite, and that's the most incredible thing about it because you're so excited about what the next what the next step is in in, in, in our technological uh, stratosphere. Does that make sense? Everything's open to possibility. Yeah. Oh yeah. Very cool. All right. Well, thanks for talking to us, Jerry. Thank you for having me.